Hey, this is Coaster30, and this is a requested tutorial on how to play O Children by the Nick, uh, my Nick Cave and the Bad Seeds on the piano. Uh, bear in mind that this song has, you know, more than one instrument, obviously. You're playing, you've got guitars, pianos in there. This is just how you, if you're going to play it on the piano, how to sort of get the best of everything so it sounds right. Um, right, there's one repeated chord pattern that you will hear in the majority of the song. It only changes, like, a little bit. Uh, from time to time, and that is the following. is an E minor chord, which is an E in the bass, and then uh, an E an octave up from that, with a G and a B, and the second chord, all you have to do is move the bass down to the C, and move your little finger up to the C just above the B, so then it's a C major chord. It's an a, mi ma a minor chord, so you just move the bass down to the A and the, your middle finger up to the A, so you're playing E, A, C. Um, then you move the bass down to the G and then you move, you like shift your hand, like keeping it the same position, down to a G, which is just uh, D. G, B, that's um, to D first inversion. No, not D first inversion, G first inversion. Yes, you play G, G major. Forget what I said about D. Next one with a D. Then you move the bass up to D. And you move your middle finger to the F sharp and your little finger to the A. So you're playing A, D major. So it should sound like this. E minor, C major, A minor, G major, D major. So as you'll um, hear in the song, there are a few little tinkly bits called um, ornaments here and there. And you get them at the end of each section, except for the intro. So the intro, you go, and then you play the first verse, you play, chord of the chord progression, so the D, you play, instead of playing two Ds like you would in the intro, you play D, and on the last note switch to the U in the bass, and then get on with the next section. So you have the first verse, which is that chord progression, then the bridge, which is the same chord progression, but at the end of the bridge, you have a different ornament. So you will play at the end of the bridge. is an E minor arpeggio, which is E, G, B, D, D, and you switch to the E bass on the last E, so. Uh, and what you do is every sort of verse, bridge, verse, chorus, whatever it is, whatever, if you're changing section, at the end of this chord progression, you will play one of the ornaments, and it alternates between, so you go, and the next section, and then you just change between the two of them at the end of each chord progression. Uh, now you play that exact same chord progression. Uh, play that <coughs> play that chord progression round and round, so the E, C, A, G, D chord progression 
run around until you get to the bit after the keys to the gulag. So when it's like... So you start off with the E, which I've already taught you, and then to go. Children. So you go C in the bass, and you're playing a C seventh chord. So you're playing E, G, C, D, and then you change to a G major, but not the one you're playing before. This one is a bit up, so. G in the bass, and then this is the root chord, so G, B, D. Lift up your voice. So then you move this down to here, so you're playing D in the bass, F sharp, A, D, and that's just a D major. Lift up your voice. You played that round twice, uh, and then that's the choruses. And then after the first chorus, you play a bridge, and that bridge is if the bass is the same as the first chord progression. So I'm going to call that chord progression chord progression one for now. So the chord progression one is one, and then the chorus chord progression is they're very similar. Um, anyway. In the bridge after the chorus, you play, it's quite similar to the second uh, ornament, you play. And what that is, is you're playing the, the right um, hand doesn't change except for on the very last bit, so you're just playing E. G, B, so E, G, B, B, D, e, e, E up. And you want to roll that, see that. And the, um, the bass is the same as the first chord progression, so it's just E, C, A, G. When you get to the D, you play, so you play. And you don't play the E bit, and then you change up to the D. Corporation until you get to the chorus again. So, so basically, uh, I've taught you the song up until you get to the second chorus. So you, then you go back to the Ooh, children. Lift up your voice, lift up your voice. That bit, um, and then after that bit, you get to part of where there's no more courses anymore it's just verses so hey little train we're all jumping on train that goes to the kingdom oh, how far we're having fun and the train ain't even left the station the little train wait for me i was once was blind but now i see i have you left to see for me is that such a That's basically playing playing what you play for the bridge, so. Apart from when you get to the D, 
you don't do that. And you just play that until the very end of the song. So from when you say start saying Hey Little Train at the beginning of everything, I'm just going to teach you this, assuming you have the lyrics. Uh, you just play that over and over again. The bass is the same as usual. E, C, A, G, D. So. on the end of that bit but you can if you want to but it can be sort of it kind of interrupts the sound um, if you're playing with a guitar in there like with someone who's playing the guitar by all means uh, keep alternating between the ornaments but I prefer to just keep going with that because it makes it sound more uh, it fills it out more um, so that's everything you need to know that's all the trills all the chords uh, but if you haven't found that enough um, go to the second video there's a link probably somewhere on screen or in the description uh, and that will guide you through it step by step uh, in uh, according to the lyrics where the chords and trills uh, ornaments sorry all go uh, and that will help you finish off the song uh, I'd also recommend you go away and listen to the actual song so you can sort of link where everything goes with that so you can get it sounding right and by all means if play around with it if you want to you know do it your way so thanks for watching uh, and go to the second video if you need to